Hello descendants, the new vendor ETA-0 is here. I'll show you real quick where he's located. If you fast travel to where Neus is, to the city entrance, you're just basically hovering over the address. Now, quick rundown on what he is. He basically is a vendor that you can sell your duplicated blueprint parts. So here I'll show you. So these are all the duplicates I've had when playing the game on my main account. As you can see, and then if I click on one of these, it gives uh, changes for some premium ETA vouchers. Now, what I found out here is that the way in the games or figures out was a 5% versus 10 per or 15% is the rarity and percentage rate of the drop. So with this one here, I was also looking at some morphic material. This is was a 6% drop, so it should slot it around 15%. Now this was like a 10% drop, which is a little bit better, so it dropped it to 10. Now this one was very easy to get, so it's a 3%. So you can see the how, based on the percentage drops, that's how much rarity or value you get for these ETA vouchers. So let me show you, because I have 15 of these. Uh, let's see. So since I have quite a few of these, let me go ahead and sell this one right here. And then on the upper right corner here, I got premium ETA. We'll go over the standard vouchers in a second. Now, if we go with the exchange supplies right here at the very bottom, you can see that the yellow with the yellow right there. And there's some really good stuff here. Storage lots. Now, important thing is some people were kind of collecting descendant slots and were saying, I don't feel like paying money for the game. Well, if you exchange some blueprints, you'll definitely be able to get some descendant slots. And uh, the hair, which was just recently released on Thursday, which is yesterday. And some colors variants and then some weapon blueprints and stuff. So I would say out of this, I would say uh, storage lots, the cinema slots if you need. Uh, I would purchase the uh, hair color just because there's more customization for your character basically for free since you've just been playing the game. And some maybe some more cosmetics. And then whatever weapons you are but i would prioritize the hair customization versus if you already have the weapons and all that now for this exchange of filtration operation rewards now this is the 400 percent increase in um, difficulty new mode that was released as well and if you do the 400 percent let me show you right right quick here if i go to my assumables miscellaneous right here so if you notice right here, this is the 400. So every week there's going to be a new rotation and all that. So you just go through those, do the 400, and you will get those tokens. Now, what do you get for those tokens? You get equipment slots times two, an energy activator, which is pretty solid. Some blueprints, a hair, and then colors. So I would say prioritize the energy activator to start and just fill in anything else for custom and all that so hopefully that was helpful and a good rundown and this is happening every week so i'll be doing a video for this so i will see you